I'm Paul Ayres. I'm president of LIBA, the Association of European Research Libraries, but I also chair the LERU Scholarly Communications Group. LERU is the League of European Research Universities. Both LERU and LIBA work very closely together on scholarly communication issues. And we're here in Amsterdam today to discuss a potential project that LERU has inspired uh, European librarians to think about in terms of addressing some issues to do with open access publishing and dissemination. If you read European research proposals, if you look at grant calls from the Commission and from the European Research Council, you'll see that they're sprinkled with references to open access as the importance of open access as a new means of dissemination and publication in Europe. So, what can libraries do? What can LIBA do to help LERU um, address that uh, agenda of making European research more available and more visible to a larger community? One of the things that libraries can do in this brave new world is to look at new forms of dissemination and new forms of publication. One of the big gaps in the European publishing uh, arena is research monographs in arts, humanities and social sciences. The current business model doesn't work. There isn't enough money in the system to fund the cost of publication uh, and individuals find the research monographs too expensive to buy them themselves. So unless something happens in this area of publication, the scholarly monograph in research, in arts, humanities, social sciences will simply disappear. Now we think that's bad for scholarship and bad for researchers. So what can libraries do to help mend the problem? What we've been discussing here in Amsterdam over the last two days is a potential new publishing project that we will eventually develop as a project for funding by the European Commission. The project is called Going for Gold. Now what does Going for Gold mean? We think that libraries can together across Europe create shared publishing infrastructure to publish research monographs in arts, humanities and social sciences themselves. By sharing the infrastructure, by sharing the editorial services and the uh, public relations activities that are required to market publications to the public, we think we can cut the costs and create uh, a publishing system which is affordable and sustainable. All the outputs that will appear from Going for Gold will be open access. There will be digital publications available free at point of use on the internet for any user that wants to read them. That's a big change to the current model because unless you can afford to buy the monograph from the publisher or have access to it in a library, you can't read the text that, that is being produced. So not everybody has access to the text they want to read or they need to read to further their research and their understanding. Open access at a stroke solves all those problems because the monograph, the book, the article, if you're talking about a journal article, these are all free at point of view. So anyone with a connection to the internet can read them whenever they want to. We believe that's a great support for research and scholarship and is something that libraries actively can do to help mend the problem that we've identified here, the fact that the current business model for research monographs is broken and unless radical action is taken, research monographs are in danger of disappearing in arts and humanities and the social sciences because nobody can afford to buy them. We believe that libraries can make a big difference in putting together and creating a shared publishing infrastructure that Europe's researchers can use, which will continue to ensure that these important publications are available to as wide a public as possible.